German Cuisine, Wikipedia Audio The cuisine of Germany has evolved as a national cuisine through centuries of social and political change with variations from region to region. Some regions of Germany, like Bavaria and neighboring Swabia, share dishes with Austrian and parts of Swiss cuisine. The Michelin Guide of 2015 awarded 11 restaurants in Germany three stars, the highest designation, while 38 more received two stars and 233 one star. German restaurants have become the world's second most decorated after France. Hot foods Pork, beef and poultry are the main varieties of meat consumed in Germany, pork being the most popular. Average annual meat consumption is 59 kg. Among poultry, chicken is most common, although duck, goose, and turkey are also consumed. Game meats, especially boar, hare, and venison are also widely available, especially in autumn and winter. Lamb and goat are less popular. Meat is usually braised, pan-fried dishes also exist, but these recipes usually originate from France and Austria. Several cooking methods used to soften tough cuts have evolved into national specialties, including sauerbraten, involving marinating beef, horse meat, or venison in a vinegar or wine vinegar mixture over several days. A long tradition of sausage making exists in Germany, more than 1,500 different types of sausage are made. Most worst is made with natural casings of pork, sheep, or lamb intestines. Among the most popular and most common are bratwurst, usually made of ground pork and spices, the wiener, which may be pork or beef and is smoked and fully cooked in a water bath, and blutwurst or swartzwurst made from blood. Thousands of types of cold cuts also are available. There are many regional specialties, such as the Munchner Weisswurst popular in Bavaria or the Currywurst popular in the metropolitan areas of Berlin, Hamburg, and the Ruhr area. Strict regulations governing what may and may not be put into them have been in force in Germany since the 13th century. In the Market Ordinance of Landshut in 1236, it was set down that only top quality meat could be made into sausages. Of saltwater fish, Alaska pollock is the most common. Popular freshwater fish on the German menu are trout, pike, carp, and European perch also are listed frequently. Seafood traditionally was restricted to the northern coastal areas, except for pickled herring, which often served in a fish brachen, as roll mops, or brathering. Today, Many sea fish, such as fresh herring, tuna, mackerel, salmon, and sardines, are well established throughout the country. Prior to the Industrial Revolution and the ensuing pollution of the rivers, salmon were common in the rivers Rhine, Elba, and Oder. Fish fingers, known as fish stabchen, are a popular processed food made using a whitefish such as cod, haddock, or pollock, which has been battered or breaded. Vegetables are often used in stews or vegetable soups, but are also served as side dishes. Carrots, cauliflower, turnips, spinach, peas, beans, broccoli, and many types of cabbage are very common. Fried onions are a common addition to many meat dishes throughout the country. Circa 1900, carrots were sometimes roasted in water, with the broth used in place of coffee. Asparagus, especially white asparagus known in German as spargel, is a common side dish or may be prepared as a main dish. Restaurants will sometimes devote an entire menu to nothing but white asparagus when it is in season. Spargel season traditionally begins in mid-April and ends on St. John's Day. 
Breakfast commonly consists of bread, toast, or bread rolls with butter or margarine, cold cuts, cheeses, jam, honey and eggs. Common drinks at breakfast are coffee, tea, milk, cocoa, or fruit juices. It is very common to eat hearty toppings at breakfast, including deli meats like ham, salted meats, salami, and meat-based spreads such as labor worst, tea worst or met worst and cheeses such as gouda, frisch case, brie, harzer roller, burgess, and more. Most bakeries tend to sell beleg brachen, especially in the morning, for people on the go. Meat Traditionally, the main meal of the day has been lunch, eaten around noon. Dinner was always a smaller meal, often consisting only of a variety of breads, meat or sausages, cheese and some kind of vegetables, similar to breakfast, or possibly sandwiches. Smaller meals added during the day bear names such as Vesper, Brat Seat, Coffee und Kuchen, literally for coffee and cake, or coffee trinken. It is a very German custom and comparable with the English 5 o'clock tea. It takes time between lunch and dinner, often on Sundays with the entire family. However, in Germany, as in other parts of Europe, dining habits have changed over the last 50 years. Today, Many people eat only a small meal in the middle of the day at work, often also a second breakfast, and enjoy a hot dinner in the evening at home with the whole family. For others, the traditional way of eating is still rather common, not only in rural areas. Breakfast is still very popular and may be elaborate and extended on weekends, with friends invited as guests the same holds for coffee and cake. Since the 1990s, the Sunday brunch has also become common, especially in city cafes. Noodles, made from wheat flour and egg, are usually thicker than the Italian flat pasta. Especially in the southwestern part of the country, the predominant variety of noodles are spatzl, made with a large number of eggs, and malt ashen, traditional stuffed noodles reminiscent of ravioli. Besides noodles, potatoes are common. Potatoes entered the German cuisine in the late 17th century, and were almost ubiquitous in the 19th century and since. They most often are boiled, but mashed and pan-roasted potatoes also are traditional. French fries called pommes frites, pommes, or regionally as fritten in German, are a common style of fried potatoes, they are traditionally offered with either ketchup or mayonnaise, or, as pommes rot slash weiss, with both. Also common are dumplings and in southern Germany potato noodles, including skupfnudeln, which are similar to Italian gnocchi. Salads also modern variations, as well as vegetarian dishes become more and more popular in Germany. Fish Vegetables With the exception of mustard for sausages, German dishes are rarely hot and spicy, the most popular herbs are traditionally parsley, thyme, laurel, chives, black pepper, juniper berries, nutmeg, and caraway. Cardamom, anise seed, and cinnamon are often used in sweet cakes or beverages associated with Christmas time, and sometimes in the preparation of sausages, but are otherwise rare in German meals. Other herbs and spices, such as basil, sage, oregano, and hot chili peppers, have become popular since the early 80s. Fresh dill is very common in a green salad or fish fillet. Structure of meals Side dishes Spices and condiments Desserts Holidays Mustard is a very common accompaniment to sausages and can vary in strength, 
the most common version being middle sharf, which is somewhere between traditional English and French mustards in strength. Dusseldorf, similar to French's deli mustard with a taste that is very different from Dijon, and the surrounding area are known for its particularly spicy mustard, which is used both as a table condiment and in local dishes such as Sinfrostbraten. In the southern parts of the country, a sweet variety of mustard is made which is almost exclusively served with the Bavarian speciality Weisswurst. German mustard is usually considerably less acidic than American varieties. Horseradish is commonly used as a condiment either on its own served as a paste, enriched with cream, or combined with mustard. In some regions of Germany, it is used with meats and sausages where mustard would otherwise be used. Its use in Germany has been documented to the 16th century, when it was used as medicine, and as a food, whereby its leaves were consumed as a vegetable. Garlic has never played a large role in traditional German cuisine, as it was long frowned upon for causing bad breath, but has risen in popularity in recent decades due to the influence of French, Italian, Spanish, Portuguese, Greek, and Turkish cuisines. Bear's garlic, a rediscovered spice from earlier centuries, has become quite popular again since the 1990s. Bread A wide variety of cakes, tarts and pastries are served throughout the country, most commonly made with fresh fruit. Apples, plums, strawberries, and cherries are used regularly in cakes. Cheesecake is also very popular, often made with quark. Schwarzwalder Kirsch tort is probably the most well-known example of a wide variety of typically German torts filled with whipped or butter cream. German donuts are usually balls of yeast dough with jam or other fillings, and are known as Berliner, Pfannkuchen, Kreppel, or Krapfen, depending on the region. Eierkuchen or Pfannkuchen are large, and relatively thin pancakes, comparable to the French crepes. They are served covered with sugar, jam, or syrup. Salty variants with cheese, ground meat, or bacon exist as well as variants with apple slices baked in, but they are usually considered to be main dishes rather than desserts. In some regions, ei or kuchen are filled and then wrapped, in others, they are cut into small pieces and arranged in a heap. The word Pfannkuchen means pancake in most parts of Germany. A popular dessert in northern Germany is Rotgrutze, red fruit pudding, which is made with black and red currants, raspberries, and sometimes strawberries or cherries cooked in juice with corn starch as a thickener. It is traditionally served with cream, but also is served with vanilla sauce, milk, or whipped cream. Rhabarbergrutze and Grüngrutze are variations of the Rotgrutze. A similar dish, Obstkaltschau, may also be found all around Germany. Ice cream and sorbets are also very popular. Italian-run ice cream parlors were the first large wave of foreign-run eateries in Germany, which began around the mid-1850s, becoming widespread in the 1920s. Spaghetti Ace, which resembles spaghetti, tomato sauce, and ground cheese on a plate, is a popular ice cream dessert. In Germany, roasted goose is a staple for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day meals. It is sometimes replaced with European carp, particularly in southern areas. The carp is cut into pieces, coated in breadcrumbs and fried in fat. Common side dishes are potato salad, cucumber salad, or potatoes. Another very common dish in Christian German culture is Wurstchen mit Kartoffel salad, sausage with potato salad. In recent years, raclette became known as a Christmas dish, too. 
while originating in Switzerland the dish has been adapted in wide regions of Germany. Bread Rolls Chocolate Easter Bunny Oktoberfest Gingerbread Beverages Roasted Christmas Goose Christmas Cookies Alcoholic Drinks Non-alcoholic drinks Regional cuisine New Year sect Bread is a significant part of German cuisine, with the largest bread diversity in the world. Around 200 types of breads and 1,200 different types of pastries and rolls are produced in about 17,000 bakeries and another 10,000 in-shop bakeries. Bread is served usually for breakfast and in the evening as sandwiches, but rarely as a side dish for the main meal. The importance of bread in German cuisine is also illustrated by words such as Abendbrot and Bratseat. In fact, one of the major complaints of the German expatriates in many parts of the world is their inability to find acceptable local breads. Regarding bread, German cuisine is more varied than that of either Eastern or Western Europe. Bread types range from white wheat bread to grey to black, actually dark brown rye bread. Some breads contain both wheat and rye flour, and often also wholemeal and whole seeds such as linseed, sunflower seed, or pumpkin seed. Darker, rye-dominated breads, such as Vollkornbrot or Schwartbrot, are typical of German cuisine. Pumpernickel, a steamed, sweet-tasting bread, is internationally well known, although not representative of German black bread as a whole. Most German breads are made with sourdough. Whole grain is also preferred for high fiber. Germans use almost all available types of grain for their breads, wheat, rye, barley, spelt, oats, millet, corn, and rice. Some breads are even made with potato starch flour. Germany's most popular breads are rye wheat, toast bread, whole grain, wheat rye, white bread, multi-grain, usually wheat rye oats with sesame or linseed, rye, sunflower seeds and dark rye bread, pumpkin seeds and dark rye bread and roasted onions and light wheat rye bread. Bread rolls, known in Germany as Brachen, which is a diminutive of brat, with regional linguistic varieties being Semmel, Schrip, Runestuck, or Weck, Weckel, Weckli, or Wecken, are common in German cuisine. A typical serving is a roll cut in half, and spread with butter or margarine. Cheese, honey, jam, Nutella, meats such as ham, fish, or preserves are then placed between the two halves, or on each half separately, known as a Belegtsbrachen. Rolls are also used for snacks, or as a hot dog style roll for bratwurst, bratel, fleischkäse, or schwenker slash schwenkbraten. Franz Brachen, which originated in the area of Hamburg, is the small, sweet pastry roll baked with butter and cinnamon. Beer is very common throughout all parts of Germany, with many local and regional breweries producing a wide variety of beers. The Pale Lager Pilsner, a style developed in the mid-19th century, is predominant in most parts of the country today, whereas wheat beer and other types of lager are common, especially in Bavaria. A number of regions have local specialties, many of which, like Weissbier, are more traditionally brewed ales. Among these are Altbier, a dark beer available around Dusseldorf and the Lower Rhine, Kolsch, a similar style, but light in color, in the Cologne area, and the low-alcohol Berliner Weiss, a sour beer made in Berlin that is often mixed with raspberry or woodruff syrup. Since the reunification of 1990, Swartz beer, which was common in East Germany, 
but could hardly be found in West Germany, has become increasingly popular in Germany as a whole. Beer may also be mixed with other beverages such as pills or lager and carbonated lemonade, Radler, Alster Wasser. Since a beer tax law was changed in 1993, many breweries served this trend of mixing beer with other drinks by selling bottles of pre-mixed beverages. Examples are Bibob, Velton's V+, Mixery, Dimix and Cab. Wine is also popular throughout the country. German wine comes predominantly from the areas along the Upper and Middle Rhine and its tributaries. Riesling and Sylvaner are among the best-known varieties of white wine, while Spatburgunder and Dornfelder are important German red wines. The sweet German wines sold in English-speaking countries seem mostly to cater to the foreign market, as they are rare in Germany. Corn, a German spirit made from malt, is consumed predominantly in the middle and northern parts of Germany. Absler, on the other hand, distilled from apples and pears, plums, cherries or mirabelle plums, is preferred in the southern parts. The term schnapps refers to both kinds of hard liquors. All cold drinks in bars and restaurants are sold in glasses with a calibration mark that is frequently checked by the e chain to ensure the guest is getting as much as is offered in the menu. Coffee is also very common, not only for breakfast, but also accompanying a piece of cake in the afternoon, usually on Sundays or special occasions and birthdays. It is generally filter coffee which is weaker than espresso. Café shops are also very common in Germany. Tea is more common in the northwest. East Frisians traditionally have their tea with cream and rock candy. Popular soft drinks include churla, juice, or wine mixed with sparkling mineral water, with Apfelschurla being popular all over Germany, and Spsi made with cola and an orange-flavored drink such as Fanta. Germans are unique among their neighbors in preferring bottled, carbonated mineral water, either plain or flavored to non-carbonated ones. Drinking water of excellent quality is available everywhere and at any time in Germany. Water provided by the public water utilities can be had without hesitation directly from the tap. Usually no chlorine is added. Drinking water is controlled by state authority to ensure it is potable. Regulations are even stricter than those for bottled water. German regional cuisine can be divided into many varieties such as Bavarian cuisine or Thuringian and Lower Saxon cuisine. Due to the physio-geographically situation, the Upper Rhine Plain with Germany's warmest climate, Fruitful volcanic soils, already in the Roman period used medicinal springs and spas with very good infrastructural features, the proximity to France and Switzerland Baden had better prerequisites to develop a high-quality gastronomy than were Temerg or Bavaria. Special plant crops such as tobacco, wine, fruit and horticulture are of supranational importance and offer the inhabitants and visitors a diverse and wide selection of local products. Asparagus and chestnuts are as skillfully used in the kitchen as tripe and escargot and a variety of fruity desserts and pastries is provided for the traditional German coffee und Kuchen. Nationwide this region features the highest density of star-rated restaurants, similar to the neighboring region Alsace which does the same for France. The Bavarian Dukes, especially the Wittelsbach family, developed Bavarian cuisine and refined it to be presentable to the royal court. This cuisine has belonged to wealthy households, especially in cities, since the 19th century. The Bavarian cuisine is closely connected to Czech cuisine and Austrian cuisine, mainly through the Wittelsbach and Habsburg families. Already in the beginning, 
Bavarians were closely connected to their neighbors in Austria through linguistic, cultural, and political similarities, which also reflected on the cuisine. A characteristic Bavarian cuisine was further developed by both groups, with a distinct similarity to Franconian and Swabian cuisine. A Bavarian speciality is the brat seat, a savory snack, which would originally be eaten between breakfast and lunch. Bavaria is a part of southeastern Germany, including the city of Munich and spreading to board with the countries Austria and the Czech Republic. The region is located at higher elevations, and is known for yielding beet and potato crops and also for the production of fine beers. Due to its century-old history as a harbour town, the traditional cuisine of Hamburg is very diversified and sapid as ingredients supply was safe. Until the 20th century, it was predominantly characterized by the extensive choice of different kinds of fish from the River Elba and the quick access to both the North Sea and the Baltic Sea, both being roughly 100 kilometers away from the city center. The neighboring regions did supply the city-state with fresh vegetables, fruit came mainly from a region called Alta's Land just southwest of Hamburg and until industrialization, the neighborhood of Wilhelmsburg was considered the Milk Isle of Hamburg. International trade made spices and exotic nutrition items from Asia and South America available since the 16th century which were soon incorporated into civic kitchens. On this basis, the cuisine of Hamburg developed its characteristics nowadays due to the super-regional harmonization of the northern German and Scandinavian cuisine. Due to its high economic importance, Hamburg does feature many internationally recognized gourmet restaurants, 11 of them were awarded with a Michelin star in 2010. Wheat, grape seed, sugar beets and barley grow well, along with a variety of vegetables, which grow near Erfurt, the state's capital. Cauliflower, cabbage, kohlrabi, and broccoli grow by traditional means near Erfurt. Tomatoes, lettuce, broad beans, onions, and cucumbers are grown in the eastern portion of the region near Jena under glass centers on about 12 acres of land. Thuringia is the second largest herb growing region in Germany. The town of Kalata was once considered the peppermint town where herb growers used to congregate to study herb cultivation. One third of Thuringia is covered in forest, and is considered to be one of the best game hunting regions in Germany. Anyone holding a valid hunting license and a local hunting permit for the area may hunt for game such as red deer, roe deer, wild boar, rabbit, duck, and mouflon. Pheasant and capercaillie are protected game species that may not be hunted. The wooded areas also contain a wide variety of edible mushrooms, such as chestnut mushrooms, porcini, and chanterelles, along with wild berries, such as blueberries, cranberries, raspberries, and blackberries, which are all traditional accompaniments to game dishes. The most famous foods from Thuringia are Thuringian sausages and Thuringian dumplings. The state is also known for its sausages, steamed, scaled, and cured varieties are all prepared. Popular varieties include Thuringer Metwurst, Feldkicher, Thuringer Laborwurst, Thuringer Rotwurst, and Met. In general the cuisine is very hearty and features many peculiarities of central Germany such as a great variety of sauces which accompany the main dish and the fashion to serve kloss or nodal as a side dish instead of potatoes, pasta, or rice. Also much fresh water fish is used in Saxon cuisine, particularly carp and trout as is the case throughout Eastern Europe. The rich history of the region did and still does influence the cuisine. In the blossoming and growing cities of Dresden and Leipzig an extravagant style of cuisine is cherished. 
Other regions where the people had to work really hard to yield some harvest and were really poor like in the Erzgebirge peasant dishes play a major role and famous dishes originating there are e.g. potatoes with quark, potato soup, or potato with bread and linseed oil. Also in the region Vogtland there were many peasants but they were wealthier and that's why in this region the Sunday roast is a tradition that is nowadays still lived up to. Cereal grain cultivation occupies 62% of the cultivated land in Saxony-Anhalt. Wheat, barley, oats and rye are grown, with the rye being grown near board, where it is used to make burger nake brat, a flatbread produced there since 1931. Another 10% of the cultivated area is planted in sugar beets for conversion to sugar popularized after the 19th century, when the region had an economic boom. The first wave of foreigners coming to Germany specifically to sell their food specialties were ice cream makers from northern Italy, who started to arrive in noticeable numbers during the late 1920s. With the post-World War II contacts with Allied occupation troops, and especially with the influx of more and more foreign workers that began during the second half of the 1950s, many foreign dishes have been adopted into German cuisine Italian dishes, such as spaghetti and pizza, have become staples of the German diet. In 2008, there were around 9,000 pizzerias and 7,000 Italian restaurants in Germany. The pizza is Germany's favorite fast food. Turkish immigrants have introduced Turkish foods to Germany, notably doner kebab. In November 2017, it was estimated that 1,500 doner kebab shops were present in Berlin. Chinese, Vietnamese, Greek and Balkan restaurants are also widespread in Germany. Before 1990, the cuisine from Eastern Germany was influenced by Russian, Polish, Bulgarian and other countries of the Communist bloc. East Germans traveled abroad to these countries on holiday, and soldiers coming to East Germany from these countries brought their dishes with them. A typical dish that came to the East German kitchen this way is saljanka. Indian, Vietnamese Thai, and other Asian cuisines are rapidly gaining in popularity since the early 2000s. Until the late 1990s many of the more expensive restaurants served mostly French-inspired dishes for decades. Since the end of the 1990s, they have been shifting to a more refined form of German cuisine. Germany is third largest agricultural producer in the European Union and the third largest agricultural exporter in the world. In 2013, German food exports were worth around 66 billion euros. Several food products are internationally known brands. Gummy bears. Liqueur. Many pretzels. Chocolate baden württemberg Lubecker marzipan Asterisk also a regional cuisine of Poland Bavaria Hamburg Hesse Palatinate slash Pfalz Thuringia Saxony International influences Food industry Notes